What's going on guys, Kaivox here and welcome to another wand video. Today I have two new wands to show you guys and I am excited about both of these. I think they both came out really good. Um, they are both completely different designs from each other so they, they don't look the same. They don't have any sort of characteristics that are similar to each other, which is cool. Um, and I think they both came out pretty close to my original idea slash design for how I wanted it to look. Here they are. Um, I don't wanna keep you guys too long, you know, so let me just show you guys them right away. So these are the handles for both of them. I think they both came out really, really cool. As you can see, they're made out of completely different woods. They have two completely different designs. And um, to be honest with you, I think both of these wands look really, really cool. And they both have, uh, cool characteristics. This one has like a little hole right there. I don't know if you can see where the uh, where the string is going through. As usual guys, um, both of these wands are eventually going to be going up for sale on the Etsy shop. It's Ender's Wands if you guys haven't seen that. It's usually up in the little eye right there. If you've seen any of these uh, or any of my past wands that are still available, um, make sure to go and check that out. And uh, let me know for sure down below which one you guys think looks cooler. Um, this red heart just looks awesome. I just love this wood, but then this wood also looks so good too. If you look really closely, you can see where it almost looks like it's, it has like hair, like it, like hair built into the wood grain itself. This was just like, a, I wanted to keep this handle as big as possible because I wanted to show off the wood grain on it. Um, this one right here, the grain is nice, but it, it's nothing like this one. It's more this wood is more about the color, that bright reddish, orangey, bright, I don't even know, almost pink, red, fiery color. This one also has a little bit of charring around the edge of the, the twist, the uh, the ribbon part of it. Um, I took a, a heat gun and I heated, um, heated it up a little bit just to kind of give it a, a different, um, a little bit of depth to, the, to that red. And it just, man, that just looks so cool, like spinning like that. Um, and then again, this one just is a traditional classic style wand, fits really good in your hand. This one doesn't fit as nicely in your hand, but it just, it looks very unique and it looks very cool. Um, I, actually, you know what, it does, it does fit pretty good. You put your thumb right there and you got a good, a good little, uh, little, little thing going on right there. And then this guy, obviously, as usual, traditional style, looks really good. So remember guys, I will be putting these wands up for sale eventually on the Etsy store. So make sure to um, keep an eye out for that. Uh, favorite the shop if you want to, if you wanna stay stay up to date with all the wands. And also subscribe to the channel if you haven't already because I always post videos of all the new wands that I'm making slash made slash still working on slash sometimes you guys help me come up with some. Yeah, I'm very happy with both of these wands. I think these are, two of my favorite wands that I have made so far. I, I say that about like every wand I make. So I don't really, I don't, I don't really get it. I don't, I can't really be saying that all the time. You know, I can't be saying all that all the time. <laughs> like I promised, I'm gonna be leaving you guys with some nice B-roll of both of these wands. So let me know down below which one was your favorite, what you guys think is the cooler one of the two. If you had to choose for yourself, which one would you choose and why? Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you guys enjoy. See you guys in the next video. Uh, bye, bye, bye.